Thanks. <laughs> She's not moving. She's not moving. That's fine. <laughs> Hi, my name is Carter. I'm a senior. I'm Jasmine. I'm a junior. I'm Joanna. I'm a junior. I'm Grace. I'm a senior. And we're from Lincoln High. And this is our poem called Cosmo.com. Hey, do you know him? Wait, do you not? He's in my math class. He's super smart. He's kind of cute. He's sweet and hilarious. Wait, hey, when's your birthday? Uh, December 14th. <sighs> Sagittarius. If I could choose my sign, it'd be a red octagon that just says stop. I mean, stop this. Can we drop this? Astrology just gets lost in the brass and noise of thousands, thousands of, of horoscopes, horoscopes telling, telling us who we're supposed, supposed to be. And no one tells you better than Cosmo.com. <laughs> April 20th to May 20th. Taurus, the choices you make today will affect your life tomorrow. Obviously. <laughs> if you let clumps of gas light years away influence your day, then, then you're, you're denser, denser than the stars you believe in. But my horoscope has saved me. All my lasting relationships have had everything to do with the stars aligning and their signs signing away accountability. But now I know I can't date a Gemini, though I'm not sure why. What's a Gemini? Oh, my mom's a Gemini. And Paul McCartney. And, and Mike, Mike Pence. Pence. They're, They're just pathetic. Ambitious. Ambiguous. Every, Every Gemini, Gemini I know is lovable. Heartless. Charming. Moronic. Different, yet somehow the same. Are we really supposed to believe that all, all these people, people are encapsulated in the same three lines in the Sunday paper? paper? all fun and games to place blame and say, well, Mer Mercury's in retrograde, but soon it won't be. And what if I'm still lonely? The choices you make today will affect your life tomorrow. Am I lazy because I'm a Libra? Am I lazy because I won't fix what Cosmo assures me isn't broken? We all love to pretend that hard, hard times caused by star signs, signs is the same as hardships caused by mistakes we make. But, but there's, there's a, a difference. difference. And ignorance is blissful, but it's tricky to dismiss all of the Cosmo clone websites begging you to believe that horoscopes, horoscopes know you better than you know yourself. yourself. See... If it's not written in the stars, then I find myself directionless. It's so much easier to connect the various points, points of my personality, not unlike stars in a constellation. When I trust a celestial entity to do, do the, the thinking, thinking for me, me, I find my security blanket becomes a straitjacket, binding me to a person I, I don't, don't know, know how, how to be. be. Astrology is a self-fulfilling prophecy. I'm only lazy because I want to be. It's, it's a, a method, method to cut corners rather than, than carve out an actual personality. personality. Self-awareness is concealed by vanity. An obsession with the cosmos can't shield me from my own shortcomings. It's, it's sickening, sickening to, to realize, realize that, that unlike the stars, I am not exempt from human nature. nature.